What's going on fishing buddies? Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm gonna to show you a one-stop surf fishing shop in the Perdido Key, Florida, Orange Beach, Alabama area. Let's get it out there. If this is your first time tuning into the channel, thank you very much. My name is Blaine Roberts. I run Perdido Blaine Outfitters, LLC. I'm running surf fishing guides and kayak fishing guides along the Gulf Coast. My main area of focus for the guides is Perdido Key, Pensacola, and Orange Beach, Alabama. I'm also offering surf fishing lessons and overnight kayak excursions along with my services. When you work hard all year, you finally get down here to your beach vacation. Time is important. You don't want to spend a lot of time hunting down things, chasing down fishing gear that you need for your trip. Lost Key Outdoors has you covered as a one-stop surf fishing shop. They also specialize in fly fishing, inshore, offshore, camping, kayaks, kayak rentals, apparel, pretty much anything you would need for the outdoors. They're located in Perdido Key, Florida, about eight minutes from the Alabama line into Orange Beach. So this is a great spot if you're staying in Orange Beach too. It's a quick drive over. Let's check out the shop. First thing I'd like to point out is outside. This is a 24 hour bait machine. Lost Key Outdoors opens at 6 a.m. They close at 5. They close at 12 p.m. on Sundays. So if you're swinging by before they open or maybe later afternoon on a Sunday, or if you're even getting prepared for an earlier morning fishing trip, you can use the 24 hour bait machine they have located in front of the store. This has everything you need for surf fishing, guys. You got pompano rigs, fish gum, fish bites, frozen shrimp, frozen mullet, squid, sand fleas, and mullet chunks. That's your basic surf fishing baits right here out front 24 hours a day. Let's go check out the shop. One of the key features that Lost Key Outdoors offers is the rental of surf fishing gear. That's huge guys. A lot of you guys are coming in on vacation and you don't own surf fishing gear. Maybe you're doing a lot of inshore stuff, freshwater stuff, seven foot rods basically. To be successful out there, you need the right equipment. You can get by with your smaller setups, your inshore rods, but you're not gonna be able to get the casting distance and really even have the weight to get those baits out there like you would with surf fishing gear. What is surf fishing gear? Nine, 10, 11, 12 foot rods. Anywhere from a 4,000 series reel to I would say about a 6,000. That's all you need targeting pompano, whiting, redfish, black drum, bluefish, your desired species that we're catching here in the panhandle. But to properly fish for those species, you need to have some weight on the end of your rod. Personally, I'm like a three ounce guy. I'm strapping on three ounces of weight 90% of the time. I will bump it up in rough conditions. So with your standard inshore seven foot rod, you can't strap three ounces of weight on that guys. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna it's gonna break your rod you can use those rods to fish up close and you can be successful catching like whiting but to get the full experience you need the gear so lost key outdoors offers a ten dollar daily rental y'all so you get a surf fishing setup and a sand spike for 10 bucks they also offer a three-day rental for 26 bucks a lot of you guys are coming down here and you're buying a three-day license in florida or alabama you have that option to buy a three-day saltwater fishing license you come up to Lost Key Outdoors, you get a three day rental, you're fishing. Very inexpensive way to catch fish on vacation, y'all. Starting this spring, 2023, they will also be offering beach cart and beach dolly rentals. This is huge, y'all. This beach cart and dolly will save you a lot of grief and a lot of hassle getting that gear onto the beach. A lot of us have kids, that means beach toys, umbrellas, chairs, snacks. So you'll be able to get your fishing gear and all your kid stuff, you can even put a kid in there, down to the beach to make your life more comfortable. If you're a one man show, the beach jolly would be great. You can get your cooler on there, your bucket, carry your rod. Now you got a little cart to get your gear down to the beach. These rentals again should kick off spring 2023. They should be ready for spring break. So in reality, if you wanted to get into like some serious fishing, you could rent one of these beach carts. You could rent like three rods. Most of us have a cooler with us anyway. Pick up some basic surf fish and tackle. And now you have greatly upped your odds of catching fish. Three lines in the water is a lot better than one, y'all. Moving into the surf fish and tackle. Lost Kia has you set up here to tie your own rigs if that's your thing. Plenty of beads, 
clamps, barrel swivels, plenty of options to choose from with colors. You have your floats. Ooh, what is that? I've never seen that one. It's like a watermelon. You got your bullet floats, your pill floats, your bigger floats. I mean, they have you set up. If you want to tie your own rigs, you can come right up here and get everything you need to do it. Again, fairly cheap. They got the bait thread for those rougher condition days where you need to tie on your bait. I'll use these when it's really rough to like hold my shrimp on, my ghost shrimp. Everything you need right here to be successful on the surf, y'all. If you're not into tying rigs or you don't want to spend the time tying rigs, they have you covered here also. This is their shop, Pompano Rigs here, double drops. And they also are a big supporter of the local guys. So Frisky Fins and Salty are two of the biggest rig makers in the panhandle. These guys know what work because they're out there fishing these waters all the time and they have guys like myself who are fishing their rigs and then reporting back to them, letting them know what's working and what's not. You can buy mass produced rigs at like Walmart, but they're all made overseas and I don't trust them. I trust the guys who are fishing these waters and picking bead color float colors to accommodate these waters. Moving into your bait, your synthetics. I catch 90% of my surf fish guys on fish bites. You also have fish gum. So with fish bites, you have different flavors. So you have shrimp, sand flea, different colors of shrimp. They also have crab, clam, a variety of different colors and scents. These are super easy to use too, guys. A little clip with the scissors, a little small piece on the hook, and you're fishing. Moving into the frozen bait, everything you need for surf fishing. I love this. They have the frozen sand fleas. So sometimes these sand fleas are hard to get, especially like in the colder months. And if you don't live here and you're not out here fishing all the time, sand fleas are hard to come by. You really don't know what to look for. You need to have a sand flea rake. So this is a great option. A little small pack of sand fleas. I will use these in the winter. When the, again, when the sand fleas are hard to get, I'll come by these frozen ones. They work great. You have all your frozen shrimp, your mullet, your mullet chunks, even got blue crab, guys. Blue crab is great pompano bait. Your finger mullet, so your smaller profile baits. I'll use this for reds. Everything you need to be successful out there, guys. Huge live shrimp tank. Got owner and operator Clint over there building a custom rod. He does that too. You want to protect yourself out there too, guys. That sun is brutal. Lonsky Outdoors has you set up with apparel also. These are great shirts. They put a lot of research in these shirts when they started designing them. And these are great quality. You want to have something like this, guys, when you're out there surf fishing for hours and hours. I know it seems counterproductive <laughs> to have like a long sleeve shirt on at the beach, but these are actually cooler than a cotton t-shirt and they protect you. Let's talk about the fly fishing in the surf that's become very popular around here. My good buddy Larry Grossman, he runs Panhandle Fly Fishing Charters out of Pensacola. He's a 30-year fly fishing guide in Colorado. Moved here to the Panhandle, started fly fishing in the surf. Everybody kind of turned their nose up at him, and he's been absolutely slaying them, y'all. He has figured out how to fly fish a surf. He's pulling in jacks, reds, pumps, and he's documenting all this on video, so he's showing the Panhandle that this can be done. So since Larry's arrival, I've seen a lot more fly rods out there on the beach. Lost Key Outdoors has you covered with the fly stuff. They have one of the largest selections of fly tying material in this area. Everything you need to get going and start fly fishing from the beach. And to get anglers on vacation going with fly fishing from the surf, Lost Key Outdoors has recently added fly fishing setup for rentals also. If you're not interested in the rentals, you want to buy some gear to really make this thing a lifestyle, Lost Key Outdoors has you covered on that also. They have branded their own gear, so it's LKO gear. They have rods, reels, apparel, backpack coolers, that, so, too much stuff to mention. And this is their surf fishing line. So they have 12 foot, 11 foot, 10 foot, and 9 foot. Your standard for surf fishing the panhandle. You have everything from a 6,000 reel down to a 4,000. So a 12 foot setup, 12 foot rod with a reel costs you 107 bucks. An 11 foot setup with a reel, $104. A 10 foot, 97 bucks. A nine foot, 94 dollars. 
You cannot beat that price for a rod and reel surf combo. And it's quality gear, y'all. Those reels, I've been using them for about eight months now. I've basically replaced all my pins with those. I would put them in the same category as like a pin battle, but they're lighter, the price point is cheaper, and the drag capacity is heavier. I use them for surf and inshore. Lost Key Outdoors has also recently added a feature to their website to make your life easier. They've got a list of captains and guides that are trusted in this panhandle area. So you can go to lostkeyoutdoors.com. I think it's under fishing charters and you can see the trusted captains and guides around this area that Lost Key Outdoors is backing. These are professionals that are coming in and out of this shop a lot. The owners here know they're catching fish. So Lost Key wanted to keep you from having to go through those sea of fishing booker websites, narrow it down to the respected captains and guides in the area. So if you did want to book a charter or a guide, you have a spot to go to find the best ones. So they have offshore listed, inshore and surf fishing guides all listed in that section of their website. Lost Key Outdoors guys, your one stop surf fishing shop in the Perdido Key Orange Beach area. Plus much more. If you will be on vacation in the area, swing by, give these guys a shout. They are more than helpful. Steve, Clint, Angela, they'll answer questions. I put you on some spots. Just a great bunch. One of my favorite places to be. I'm getting out of here. I'm going fishing. Till next time, fishing buddies.